What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. I got a few videos for y'all today. Um, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, and Happy Kwanzaa, and all the other stuff. And if you don't believe in Christmas and what it stands for, at least believe in the food and give a gift or two. All right. So we about to get into um, Adam and Wack 100 speaking about Krishan per usual. Y'all might hear um, Mango on the back because he has to get uh, crate trained, and he don't like that. And I don't like it either. But you ain't about to keep having me up at, at 6 o'clock in the morning. Hell wrong with him. All right. He will Krishan rock you. No? What does that mean? So whack. Uh, Call the cops. Uh, yeah. Call the cops. She's a cop. Call the... She's a snitch, huh? We yeah, put her in that you box her. now. You're you right. Her. You're right. She said... So, well, at least we found out that Krishan actually did call the police. I'm calling the cops and she called them. I mean, so much has taken place in the Blueface universe. She's been coming by the house every day for the last three, four days, bro. Trying to do what? Pulling Just up, talking out? about, don't you want to see the baby? Krishan, he don't want nothing to do with Junior. She's going to have to get over it, y'all, unfortunately. And I know <coughs> a lot of y'all don't like that. But, like, for real, when you're in a, when you're in a situation where you got to do you, you know what I'm saying, as the woman... That's what you got to do. Real shit. And he's still maintaining that it's not his, right? Straight up. He said it looked like Charles Barkley. <laughs> um, Is that an insult? Scotty Pippen. Um, Kevin Garnett. He said it looked like everybody but him. Every basketball player? She called me on the live. She had his phone. She left with his phone. Right. Um, the same case, Blueface caught in Vegas. She did the same shit. What do you mean? And said it. I took his phone. Like, you take them off. You got to remember, these iPhones are over, like, $750. So it's considered a felony. Right. That's a good point. And she's dumb. And I'm telling her, dumb ass, stop saying, yeah, I took his phone. You live. And then she got the fucking baby on the front seat. No car seat. That's Cap. And that's what she was trying to get out the front seat to say. But that's why you don't need to go to his house, Krishan. He's setting you up. But she got her ass in that back seat and put him in the back seat. I'm not gonna lie, I missed it too. I'm like, uh, what the fuck going on? She had already put him in the back seat. She just got out the car to do it. You know, you can't yeah. have a baby on the front seat till they like, like eight years old. Or I know. A certain weight. Baby's on the front seat just rolling around. And keep in mind that like Britney Spears at Somebody one point in her C career. What is it called? C at one point. CPS. What does they call that shit? CPS. Yeah. Br Britney, Britney Spears had a right. huge scandal because she was driving her car with her kid on her lap because she was trying to get away from the paparazzi. You can't. You can't. She do was that. driving like in a parking lot, like not a far distance, and she got in the Bro. media for that. How do paparazzi expect you to be calm when you record me randomly just for nothing? I would not want to be any of these celebrities, y'all. Don't ever think a celebrity. Don't ever think that anybody. Some people do hate on celebrities because they never walked a mile in them shoes. But yeah, I like being able to go to Target and, sh and shit, and people not popping up in my door. Oh fuck that! Nobody yeah. gives a. F Blueface and Krishan are just driving around with the kids doing no, God knows what. They only give a when they say Blueface did something. Mm. Now, here you got this, bro, because Blueface exposes, right? He says, you got this baby over here laying on the front seat, no car seat in the car. So she says, oh, you hit me, you hit me. Now, listen, bro. She said that before he said anything about the car seat. Blueface is pretty good with his hands, strong with his hands. She said... You have blood on your hands. If Blueface hit this bright yellow ass girl that hard to where he's bleeding, she's sitting here, makeup is flawless. But she had to say something, she's smart, to deflect from the baby. So I don't disagree with the part of um, he has hands. Clearly he just be missing. But a lot of y'all don't believe that he put his hands on her. Um, a lot of y'all be in my comments saying <clears throat> that y'all don't believe it. Now, we've watched him put his hands on her, so he can do it. Do I think he be doing it? Yeah. Jaden even admitted to him doing it. You just beat our ass. He's just smart enough not to go for that face and directly to hit that face. Clearly, that would be a problem. Laying over there on the front seat. But let's be real. A lot of times when you're in a domestic violence situation, which it's been a long time since I've been in one. She don't live there. You're not going full throttle. You're not beating her like it's a man. He I never mean, let her in. He saw her on the cameras and came out with his phone. What are you doing here? Can you leave? But didn't she snap a bunch of her 
fingernails off in the process. I felt like maybe the blood had transferred. Is that a black thing? I didn't see her s snap her nails. <laughs> From the fingernails. It, feel, it no looked like they were, they were maybe having a little grab. He definitely grap. had blood on his hands. Playing match type thing. He had no blood on his hands. He didn't have nothing on but his hands. But that's what she's saying in the car. She's saying, look at the blood on your hands. Because you can't really want, see it in the clip. She don't but. want people to, to think about the baby that's on the front seat. Mm. Nah. There's no car seat in the vehicle. Right. And Krishan, this is the type of shit you get when you go over a nigga house, A, uninvited, but B, even if the nigga do invite you, he's trying to set you up. I would never go fuck with a nigga who continuously trying to set me up. She's up. And I also wouldn't go with a woman who's continuously setting me up neither. Fit as a mother. She's unfit as a human being. Damn. Whoever her family, friends, or loved ones, they need to really sit down with her, man, and try to get her some help. But somebody, I'm telling you, she got a lot of enemies out there. They're going to call CPS on her ass. Whose enemies? And she got a bunch of them. All these people, I guess she'd be like taking off on. I don't know these people. I don't f with her like that. Right. You know what I'm saying? So So you're telling me Blueface was able to move past the whole ops linking up thing where Jaden and Krishan temporarily became best friends and got drunk together? Like, that seems like a lot to move that's past over for Blueface. With. It should have never happened. It's over with. See, look, Rock's on a, at a decline. You think? I know. Really? She only pops up when she needs something for the people to talk about. Hmm. If he texts her or calls her, she records it and puts it up. Any little thing, because she's not on the side of him every day. Hmm. To get it. She knew how to trigger him. Fucking, I'm in the house. I'm going to tell the house up. Record it. Right. Think about it. Everything that the world knows. Why would that benefit her to tear the house up and record it? No. Actually, every time she tabbed the house, he records it. About them, she recorded it. I thought that was very uncriptly, like, but whatever. Right. When you see him recording, it's for him to protect himself. Yo, look, she's out of my house, I'm asking her to leave, because she will lie. Mm. I felt like I got a bit of a taste of what it's like to be Blueface when I was going through my whole, you know, cuck scandal oh arc. And just because, you know, it was so easy during that time period to just put out stuff about our relationship or about the scene coming out. And shit was just like so viral beyond anything I had ever put out in my entire life. But at the same time, it was like once that momentum kind of ran out it was just like okay like it became less interesting to the people over time we did the reality show there was another upward trend but for the most part it's something that i can kind of like turn on and off it occurs to me that blueface in his situation it's just like a non-stop viral machine because this <laughs> is his real life but it's not it's viral but he's also but dealing serious. with people who are orchestrating to go viral without necessarily even like intending for it to be like that definitely intend for it to go viral every time because Krishan just creates content out of there every single go. thing that happens. There you have it. There you have it. You so it's kind of being done too. Sorry, y'all. She's not the only one creating content from this, and she's not the only one getting money from this. They so full of shit in that, in that way. Like, if you're going to talk about her, be real. And if you're going to talk about him, say it all. That's the only thing I dislike about these niggas and them talking about Krishan, bro. <laughs> Krishan ain't no saint. She's nowhere near innocent. Facts. But why are we speaking about Blueface like he's just, he's just trying to protect himself. He, he don't do no wrong. He ain't trying to go viral. What? That would be a fucking lie. <laughs> Yo, that shit crazy. If all I'm going to be wrong, let all I'm be wrong now. Him as well as him doing it himself. Because whenever there's a lull in the controversy with Blueface, he pops out and he says, yeah, Megan Thee Stallion sucked my Exactly, because he wants to go back viral as well. Another viral well, inferno. Crazy, right? So she calls the police, right? Right. This motherfucker ignores that statement. That's crazy. But only she couldn't wait for the police. She's like an impulse thinker. Mm. Why, why would you call the police and can't wait for the police? Because she got like seven million warrants. Mm. Now, that's really? Yeah, she calls him. Krishan, that's fucking crazy. So we all over here trying to figure out why the hell we think that you lying about calling the police. You ain't lying about calling the police. You're calling and you're leaving the scene. No, you do say, I wasn't there. That's not going to help your case. Now, only thing I don't agree with Krishan on, like, 
expeditiously. Pay them fucking fines, bro. Come on, man. Ain't no way I'm just going to let the law just have me in their pocket like that because I don't want to just pay them. Just pay them. You can't wait for them. You can get a lawyer to do that. You ain't even got to go. So she leaves. So now we got cops at the house. So the cops show up and they're just confused. Yeah, because we ain't going to talk to them. We ain't called you. And they're just wondering, where's, where's the girl at? Where's the girl we talked to? Right. Normally, the domestic violence victim doesn't just the leave. The dispatchers tell them it's a female. Right? There's no female here. So now they say, well, there's a female in the house. Man, you're not coming in this house, man, disturbing this house. And so you were there for all this? Well, you know, I, I was uh, like 10 minutes away. You pulled up once yeah, you got cracking? Yeah, pulled up. Yeah. But, you know, usually when you tell her I'm coming, she'll leave. Hmm. She leaves. When's the last time they had sex? I don't know, bro. I mean, she just covered up. She she violated the dude, <clears throat> lied on him, called him all kind of F-bombs. She covered up his little face. Why are you, why, how do you, like, to all the fans out there, what is the psyche of somebody that you're this, I covered you up, she tats another dude's name on her. Really? And then she's been coming to the house every day for three, four days straight, confessing her love. Yeah, we don't have that psyche. We don't know why the hell Krishan put that new nigga name on her and they not even together. That part I can't defend. I don't know why she did it. Crazy hell. Is Jaden yeah, there during this? No. Jaden, uh, Blueface brought her another brand new house. Elevator, big shit. Really? Big boy. So he has the camo house, another house, and then another house for well, her? I sold the camo house. Really? Yeah. How much? We were partners on that. How much that It wasn't made 3.9. That's a 3.9-er? Yeah. Isn't that, and it's pretty far away, but it's it's a, it's a big spot. 3.9. It was kind of fucked up. We only owe, no, we only owe like a million one or something. The so. basement <laughs> was weird. The ceiling was really low. <clears throat> I don't know why. That I, wasn't I basement. That. that was a garage. Really? Yeah, they did. It was a garage. That's a garage? The garage. The big door. You could have fooled garage me. door. It was a garage. Okay. Let me answer this. How how does Blueface have this big beef with X4 on Instagram stories and whatnot, and then now X4 is opening for him at the show well, that is actually going to take place in a few hours? But once again, right? Once again. Whack to the rescue? No. No? The kid, I genuinely like the kid. He just took what I said the wrong way. I ain't say nothing bad so about it. So this the nigga who, um, and, um, you know what? It don't even matter because I done accidentally clicked on somebody's shit. That the the part that we needed was over with. Um, listen, bro. If I was Krishan, um, of course we all know that we would stop going over there and you know what I'm saying shit like that. But for some reason, she likes this abuse. You know what I'm saying? She likes um, being treated this way and being spoke to by these about being spoke uh, spoken about by these men. And I mean, she was getting on the phone with Wack like she could confide in that nigga when she got on the phone with him. Crazy. No. One thing we can't defend is Krishan her antics of. I don't know, her revenge or what. I don't know. Um, but one thing we can say is Blueface is not the only one out here showing his ass. Or, excuse me, Krishan ain't the only one out here showing his ass. He plays a part in this shit show. I just hate that Wack B. Wack don't call it out for real what he, you know, what Blueface does. Now, I, if he my homeboy or my artist or whatever, I'm not about to come out and be like, yeah, he be beating women either. Um, but I will say, yeah, them niggas be both of them. Y'all, they be tripping. I don't know what the hell wrong with them niggas. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, he on the payroll. I'm not. Y'all let me know what y'all thinking about this down in the comment section below. Um, do you think Hershon needs to absolutely leave these motherfuckers alone? Okay. Um, or do you think she should try to go to his house and make him be a dad? And that's another thing. Y'all cannot make these men be dads. That's not how that work. He already is by law. And 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 uh you know, by blood if 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 we know cuz he claimed that he is not the father right now. Scientifically proven, Joe. So 
He know he the daddy. In the event, he is the daddy. And he know he came at her. He know what they did. That's the job was done, uh, friend. With him, his job was done after that. Unfortunately, can't make a man be a man and you can't make them take care of their seed. That's something they got to want to do. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. And Merry Criminal.